Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. First of all, before we get into the video, I want to apologize. There is construction going on downstairs of my block apartment, so I apologize and I do apologize for the traffic. I'm working on that, as I mentioned in the other video, trying to figure out a little better space where we don't hear the traffic and we don't hear the construction. Anyways, just wanted to mention that and put it out there because we're gonna hear it in this video. So today's video is all about me testing out the Ole Henkerson banana eye cream for a week to see the results, to see if it is worth $52 because $52 for an eye cream is really expensive but if it works, I mean it's somewhat worth it too. So if you don't know what the eye cream looks like, it does look like this here. So when you open it up, it does have that banana color to it like this. You do get quite a lot. Like, it's expensive, $52 is quite expensive, but you do get a lot of it inside. You will hear my final thoughts at the end of this video. I just wanted to show what it looks like if you guys are not familiar with this brand. I know I've been hearing so much about this brand and that eye cream. I needed to test it out to see if it was worth $52 because if I'm gonna spend $52 on something, I want it to work. This video will be clips of me every day of the week starting Tuesday from last week all the way to today to see the evolution of what my under eyes look like and to see if it changed, if it didn't, uh, if I like it, if I don't. So if you're interested in seeing my final thoughts, then definitely keep on watching this video. And if also you wanna see the evolution of the cream, then also keep on watching. Before you do, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and ring the bell to get notified every week when I upload my new video. So now we are going to go back in time to last Tuesday to see the evolution of the eye cream throughout a week. Okay, so today we are Tuesday. I did try the cream a little bit last night um, just to try it out. I didn't see much difference, but first day, like I went to bed straight away. I didn't really like think of it, but this morning I did apply it. And as you can see, it leaves that kind of glowy effect, kind of like when you apply a moisturizer to your face, which I really enjoy because I don't know, it makes you feel like you have glowy skin and I always love glowy skin. So as I mentioned earlier, we are Tuesday today, so I will be doing an update a little bit every day to see if it makes a difference um, as the days goes on. So if my under eye circles look less dark, more awake, things like that. Okay, so I will update you guys tomorrow, see if there is any changes to my under eyes. Hey guys, so we are the next day. Today we are Wednesday. I believe yes we are <laughs> and just going on my update and as you can see I have just applied the cream right now not much change honestly since yesterday I also saw on the packaging that it is said to be also a very good base for makeup so I'm not sure if it's more focused on the eye cream point of view or like the base for makeup uh, we will see for sure but honestly though the feeling when you put it on feels really good like it feels refreshing a good eye cream you know but is it worth 52 dollars i don't know yet <laughs> hey guys so i'm back with today's update we are thursday today and i just wanted to show you i feel like my under eyes are getting better and i guess i'll see more when i edit the footage but i really feel like i look more awake and it does really feel good i just just applied it under my eyes so far so good i don't know what else to say but the fact that i think i'm seeing a difference from what i think i saw the previous days hope you guys have a good day and we'll see you tomorrow hey guys so we're currently friday and i wanted to update you guys i can't see very well because it's so bright out um hopefully you guys can see under my eyes i'm kind of doing a close-up here but i feel like my under eyes are really better than they were the first like since the first update, I really feel like it's making a difference. That's really great. I'm really happy about that. We'll see each other tomorrow for the next update. Hey guys, so it is currently 4.30 in the morning. I cannot go back to sleep 
and I had to wake up at 6 anyways to go to work so I thought I would get up right now I'm not talking loud because everybody in the building is sleeping so yeah today we are Saturday and my skin is very glowy today I still really enjoy it I do think that it is a good base for makeup so you can clearly see where I put the cream here I feel like my under eyes are bad but that's because I just woke up and it's 4.30 in the morning, so. I am back. The clips are done. I hope you guys liked this type of video of me having little parts of different days for you to see the evolution of the product. I really enjoyed doing that because I could see for myself with the footage how my under eyes would change. And to be honest, I do believe that it is worth the buy. I don't think that $52 is fair in the sense that it is really expensive for an eye cream but I would repurchase this product. I do understand that eye creams are something that are expensive but $52 really like I have just tested out this product for a week um, but I will continue to test it out. If you want to keep up with the evolution I will definitely do updates on my Instagram so definitely Follow me on there, I will link it right here. After a week, I can see in pictures that my under eyes look different. I will insert some pictures right now. From the first day, I started with the cream and the last day. It does say that it is a good base for makeup, but even if you do not wear makeup, it's fine too, it still works. Uh, I thought at first it was just meant to be a base for makeup, so I was kind of confused. But most of the days that I was using this cream, I was not putting makeup. Wearing makeup or not, this cream is really good. It is, it is vitamin C and collagen boosted, so that is really good. Anything vitamin C for me, I love on my face. I feel like my face just takes all that vitamin C that it can get. So if you're someone that really enjoys products with vitamin C, I would really encourage you to try this out. I know it's expensive, but if it works, I feel like it's worth it in the end, you know? Before we end this video, I am going to zoom you guys in so you can really see my under eyes and what they look like. Okay, so this is a real close up here, but as you can see, it's not too bad. Like, it is really helping with the puffiness. I feel like it has really helped in that sense. I do still see though my dark circles, but I feel like that's something that is normal. Um, I am tired, so when you're tired, your under eyes are dark. But after a week of using this product, I'm really impressed. So that is it you guys for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you want more of these. And we'll see each other next week. Bye guys.